as you can imagine, it is gusty out here. Of course, my hair flying everywhere. Not just that, the flags out here on the parkway flying everywhere as well. We're going to take a look at them as I kind of step out of the way. You can see across the parkway just whipping winds for us here in Center City. And this is a theme that we're going to continue with through not just here this morning, but into the early afternoon hours as well. Current gusts right now across the region. What we're talking about, of course, you were saying gusts this morning as high as 60 miles an hour in some spots, but right now we sit upwards of 30 to 40 miles an hour with our wind gusts here as we head through the noontime hour. And of course, the biggest thing with these winds, we're always concerned with certain impacts that could be something that we uh, are watching when we have these strong winds. So in this situation, of course, with the wind advisory, we're staying aware of impacts like the potential for maybe a down tree limb here or there. We're also potentially watching for the impacts that could include a down power line, a down power pole. We did have that rain last night, softens up the ground a little bit, and then strong wind gusts could mean that those power poles could fall down again. A tree limb that falls onto power lines also potentially causing problems. One of those could, of course, be the potential for power outages. We're going to be keeping an eye out for that with our wind advisory that does continue through the rest of the afternoon and into the evening. And finally, our winds all day, they're going to be making it feel a whole lot colder than what our actual temperatures are. So even right now, as we head through lunchtime and end into the early afternoon, wind gusts are going to be making it feel like we're in the 20s, maybe Maybe even the teens in a couple of spots. So while our temperatures might feel a little bit on the cold side, the actual air temperatures that are maybe in the 40s right now, again, feeling like we are in the 20s. So that's why you need the gloves, the hats. You're going to be bundling up here in Center City, not just still here in the early afternoon, but throughout the rest of the daytime hours as well, and probably even tonight and to end our work week. So live with the Mobile Weather Watcher, I'm meteorologist Matt Peterson. Let's head it back into the studio.